She is known for her impressive career in theater, film, and television, having been nominated for three Tony Awards and winning one in 1962. She is recognized for her outstanding supporting performance in The Carpetbaggers, which earned her nominations for both the BAFTA and Golden Globe Awards. Elizabeth Ashley is her name. In the world of American acting, there is one name that stands out, Elizabeth Ashley. Born as Elizabeth and Cole, she has made a significant impact in theater, film, and television. With three Tony Award nominations under her belt, she emerged victorious in 1962 for her performance in Take Her, She's Mine. Not only that, Ashley's talent caught the attention of critics and audiences alike, earning her nominations for the prestigious BAFTA and Golden Globe Awards for her supporting role in The Carpetbaggers. But Ashley's success didn't stop there. In 1991, she received an Emmy Award nomination for her outstanding performance in the TV series Evening Shade. Her versatility as an actress was showcased through her appearances on popular talk shows like The Tonight Show with Johnny Carson, where she made a stunning 24 appearances. Television viewers also got to witness Ashley's talent in action as she graced the small screen in memorable roles. One of her notable appearances was in the hit series, In the Heat of the Night, where she portrayed the character Maybelle Chesborough in several episodes. And in 1974, she made a guest appearance on Mannix in the episode titled The Dark Hours. Elizabeth Ashley's career milestones and achievements are a testament to her exceptional talent and dedication to her craft. Her impact and legacy continue to inspire aspiring actors and entertain audiences around the world. Elizabeth Ashley's career as an actress spanned over five decades and encompassed a wide range of roles in theater, film, and television. She was a force to be reckoned with on Broadway, earning critical acclaim and a Tony Award for her performance in Take Her, She's Mine. This was just the beginning of her success on the stage. She continued to shine in iconic productions such as Neil Simon's Barefoot in the Park and Tennessee Williams' Cat on a Hot Tin Roof, earning Tony nominations for both performances. Ashley's ability to captivate audiences with her talent and versatility was evident as she took on the role of Dr. Livingstone in Agnes of God and seamlessly stepped into the character of Maddie Fay in the original Broadway run of August, Osage County. While her contributions to the theater world were remarkable, Ashley also made a significant impact in the world of film. She appeared in major motion pictures throughout her career, showcasing her acting prowess in movies like The Carpetbaggers, Ship of Fools, and The Third Day. Her filmography includes a diverse range of roles, from the comedic, paternity, to the thrilling, coma, and even a villainous turn in the controversial film, Windows. Not only did Ashley leave her mark on the stage and screen, but she also formed a notable partnership with the legendary actor Burt Reynolds. Their collaboration began in the late 1960s with an episode of Love, American Style, and continued with the film Paternity in 1981. They later reunited on Reynolds' television series, B.L. Stryker, and Evening Shade, where Ashley portrayed the beloved character Aunt Frida Evans. Throughout her career, Ashley made appearances on various television shows, leaving a lasting impression with her performances. From the miniseries, The Two Mrs. Grenvilles, to guest roles in popular shows like Murder, she wrote, and Law and Order, Special Victims Unit, she showcased her talent on the small screen. Notably, she portrayed Aunt Mimi in 14 episodes of the HBO series, Dream, further solidifying her versatility as an actress. Elizabeth Ashley's career was a testament to her immense talent and ability to bring characters to life. With a Tony Award, memorable performances on Broadway, an extensive filmography, and a presence on television screens, she left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry. Her legacy continues to inspire and captivate audiences to this day. Do you want to explore more actors? Who do you want to see featured next? Subscribe and leave a comment below to let me know. I'll see you in the next video.